Here's part two for day 21 of Advent of Code. In the first part, we narrowed down our list of ingredients and allergens to figure out which ingredients might correspond to which allergens. And using that, we were able to figure out how many ingredients there are that don't contain any allergens. And that was the answer to part one. Now here in part two, we need to take what was left then and assemble a list of our canonical dangerous ingredients. Now, it looks like some of the work we did in part one may have drastically simplified what we need to do here in part two. So what they want us to do is take sort of our isolated results and figure out which allergen goes with which ingredient, which we actually did. So you can revisit part one if you're curious how that process worked out. And then using those pairings, we then need to arrange them alphabetically based on the uh, name of the allergen, and then take each of those ingredients from that alphabetical list, alphabetical list, and append them together with commas. And that will be the answer to part two. So not too much work to do for, for this part. So if I jump back over here, this is the list that we extracted in part one. Um, we basically took this uh, list of allergens to ingredient lists, and we did a bunch of set uh, operations to narrow down the, those lists to figure out which ingredients might correspond to which allergens, and then we were able to do a little manual process of elimination then to get down to this list. So since we've already done that, we just need to take this, copy that over, open up part two, we'll paste that in, and then I want to say, so we wanna sort these, so we can say allergens to ingredients, dot sort and we'll get the so we can give sort a block and in that case we have to tell it how to compare things uh, for the sort using the block so we will get a key and a value for each so the key is the allergen and the value is the ingredient but we don't care about that in this case yeah we don't care about that in this case so We'll split it open like that, and we will say, "Oops!" And I haven't even got this quite right. We'll get the, uh, we'll get two, this this block. The values that come into this block will be two things. The first will be uh, one allergen ingredient pair that we want to compare to. Then the second, which is another allergen and ingredient pair. So we'll have pair one and pair two, I guess. And so then we will say pair one is going to be a tuple array. So we'll say it out first. And we'll use this little rocket thing to tell it how to compare them out first. And I think that'll give us a sorted list. And then from there, we can join, join maybe map map out and we'll get the, um, we'll ignore the allergen, we'll take the ingredient, we'll return the ingredient, and we'll join them with just a comma, and that'll be the result. I don't even need to pry, and we'll just run that and see if it if it does what we want it to. Not quite part one. Did I say part one? Wow, just deleted all that. Pair one. Cool. We'll run that again. All right, and we get this right here. So let's take that and plug it in and see if that is our alphabetically sorted 
canonical dangerous ingredient list. It is. We got our second gold star for the day. That's it for day 21. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow for day 22.